everyone today we're going to be doing some lovely carrot muffins and the first thing we would need to do is line our muffin tray and then we're going to get started so in this bowl here we have two eggs and then to that we're going to add a half a cup of sugar and a teaspoon of vanilla and a half a cup of vegetable oil and we're going to give this a good stir until it becomes nice and thick. So as you can see, the color is changing and I can feel the sugar dissolving with the vegetable oil. Okay, so I've been whisking this mixture for the last five minutes and um, I recommend you using an electric whisk because it gets very tired. <laughs> so now the mixture is ready and we're going to add in our uh, carrots and then we're going to work with the dry ingredients. So for this we're going to be needing one cup of carrots and the carrots give it a lovely sweetness and also extra moisture. Turns into a beautiful orangey color. Get a good mix. And then we're going to start with our dry ingredients. So in this bowl I have one and a three quarter of uh, cups of flour. And you can use normal wheat flour or all pur purpose flour. And then I have a teaspoon of nuts, neg and a teaspoon of cinnamon powder. And then I have a quarter teaspoon of salt and a teaspoon of baking soda. So we're going to combine all this, I'm just going to give it a bit of a mix. And then we're going to add in our wet ingredients. Combine it until it's nicely mixed and then we're gonna add some pecan nuts. I've got about a half a cup of pecan nuts that we're gonna put in into the mixture and then we're also gonna save some for the top of um, our cream cheese frosting. Okay so now we're gonna put in about three quarters of our pecan nuts and we're gonna save the rest for the topping on our cream cheese frosting and we're gonna give this a good mix you can also add in some raisins or whatever seeds you like to make it a bit more exciting and then we're gonna fill up our muffin um, trays. So we're gonna fill up our muffin cases now and don't fill it up too uh, much because then it's just gonna flop and it's not gonna look very nice. So we fill it up three quarter ways and when it bakes it will bake nicely. So while the muffins are baking, uh, and I forgot to say that we have to bake it at 180 degrees for about 20 minutes or until the skewer comes out clean. Um, and now we're going to be making the cream cheese frosting. So I'm going to put 115 grams of cream cheese in here and 4 tablespoons of butter. And we're going to whip this up nicely until it comes light. And then we're going to work with the icing sugar. Oh, 
kernel cream cheese until it's nice and fluffy. And it turns into a nice pale color. So I've sifted two and a quarter cups of icing sugar and we're gonna add this to our cream cheese mixture. And we're also going to add in a teaspoon of vanilla essence. But we're going to add the icing sugar in parts. So we're just going to do it maybe in two or three parts so that it doesn't fly all over. Add in your vanilla. You can also add in some almond extract or orange essence, whatever you like to change the taste. and then put it into the fridge for a few minutes and then we're going to start icing our muffin once the muffins are cold. So now that our carrot muffins are done we're just going to um, put the cream cheese frosting over and you can put as much or as little as you like Start from the outsides and then I'll work myself in. And then we're just gonna put some pecan nuts on top. There you have it, lovely carrot cake muffins. Hope you enjoy this recipe and enjoy your holidays as well.